scary moments for Walmart shoppers in Chantilly tonight. Something caused smoke and fire, forcing an evacuation. Luckily, no one was hurt. Ross Plater is live at the scene. Ross, at first we saw, thought this was some kind of explosive device. Indeed, customers heard a loud noise, and so that is probably how that got started. But I just got off the phone a few minutes ago with Captain Randy Bittinger from uh, Fairfax County Fire. He says, uh, despite the reports, there was not was not a bomb that went off inside the store. There was a small fire that a worker was able to put out with a fire extinguisher, but there were some tense moments indeed because there was smoke in the store. There were evacuations. Uh, one customer, uh, Colleen Johnson, was inside. Here's how she described what happened. I was near the electronics and I heard what was sounded to me like actually was like a gunshot. Um, like it was just a loud boom. An announcement came on over the loudspeaker that said, you know, all you know people in Walmart need to leave the building. By that time, I was looking over at the area and it, it looked like you know a fog. And then when someone pointed out it was smoke, as I was walking out the store, it looked kind of on that you know every there were shopping carts that were empty and. Like people just abandoned them and walked out. There was at least six to eight fire trucks that came in from all sides of the building. Well, indeed, we're told the fire marshals are now investigating what might have caused that fire and whether or not it was anything suspicious. We should know more in the day or so to come. For now, we're live in Chantilly. I'm Ross Plater, News Channel 8.